We have a lot of our choir members and church members still out of town for the holidays, but we're also, it's good to see some of you who are visiting from out of town. I have to look forward to seeing you after the service. This is the first Sunday we have the 2018 flower calendar up. Uh, this is when uh, people are invited to give the flowers for our worship service and usually in honor of a loved one or in memory of a loved one. And you have first crack at it. <laughs> Being here on New Year's Eve, the, the flower calendar is blank right now. It's over in the narthex, I believe on the wall as you're about to go out into the courtyard. So take advantage of this day. If you have a favorite day you want to remember, somebody whose birthday it was, they're $60 for both arrangements. You have the option of taking them both or leaving one or leaving both. The, those flowers that are left, and many of you know this already, but if you're new to the, the church, we have a wonderful flower ministry here, and the flowers that are left at the church are then arranged by our flower team and then delivered to people to offer them some cheer. Um, usually it's, we send them to people who are sick or who are bereaved, or maybe they're celebrating something wonderful like a birthday or anniversary. So take advantage of it today uh, because it will start filling up, all right? This Tuesday at 6.30, it'll be the time to put our Christmas decorations back up. Um, so if you can come help us, we would appreciate it. That's this Tuesday at 6.30. And then as Preston mentioned, we do have a new member class um, at the end of January, the last two um, Sundays in January. We have classes three times a year, so it's about one of those times right now. If you would like to participate, just email me or call Candace or Claudette at the church office. You know, 